Hey everybody, what's going on? Superman Ryan here, and we are back with some more Pokemon TCG Online. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be doing yet again another online battle. I'm actually, going to cancel that. You <laughs> use the fire deck this time, so you guys have something new to look into. Let's see. Magic Turtle. Magic Turtle, if you are in the comment section below, let us know so we can give you a huge shout out. That is an awesome ass coin. Magic Turtle is going to call the coin flip. Is she going to get it right though? I always get it wrong. I don't know what it is about me, but I always, always, always get it wrong. And of course, she got it right. Every time. Every time. I never, never, ever, ever do I ever win the coin toss. That is awesome card pack. Uh max though that is really cool your opponent had no basic okay had no basic cards let's see so we're gonna go ahead and throw magic carp up there i probably could have thrown articuno up there but i think we're gonna hang back with articuno because that's not that's not even the articuno that i like this however is the gyarados that i like so hopefully we can pull a um Let's see what you got. So, Ninja Boy. Ooh. Ooh, Haunter. Okay, okay. Anyway, hopefully we can pull a normal element. Um, a double normal element. That way we can throw that up on Magikarp with the energy uh, while he's evolved into Gyarados. And get to work with this Berserker Splash. And then eventually the Aqua Tail. Hell yes, I want to draw another card. Hell to the yes. Let's see, so we're going to go ahead and draw three more cards. And we did, we pulled it, boys. Oh yeah. So we're going to throw that up there. Oh, I can't evolve him yet. We're going to throw this over here. Okay. And we're going to end that turn right there. What does Ghastly have? Sleep Poison. Flip a coin of heads, your opponent active. Your opponent's active Pokemon is now asleep and poisoned. That is a deadly, deadly com uh, combination. You know, honestly, I don't think I've ever actually been poisoned on this game. Ooh, ooh, he did get me. One opponent's poison, but one damage counter on it between turns. Oh, so it's only, ooh, yo, though, um... We're gonna go ahead, evolve this bad boy into Gyarados. I'm gonna go ahead and use this. I know they don't have a whole lot of benched Pokemon, but that is okay. We throw this up on Gyarados, and we are gonna take this uh, Ghastly out. And we have Diglett to worry about next turn. What do we got as a prize card? And okay, okay, I can deal with that. I can deal with that though. Oh, well, Magic Turtle, I hope you have a card to use, because I just, I just once gave up. Fuck me, right? I have this happen to me all the freaking time. All the time. Yo, you people think that, I mean, I guess, technically, I would have won that fight anyway, because my Gyarados would have obviously taken out her Diglett. Um, however... I have this happen all the time, like legit. As soon as people think that they're getting ready to lose, even if they're not, even if they're not going to lose, even if they could come back to it the next turn, um, I'd come back for the win, they still think that they're going to lose, and they just give up. But right now we're going to use the fire and fighting type deck for y'all. Uh, you have yet to see this deck in action, I believe. Now, this is a deck that I'm testing right now. Pablito2000, if you are in the comment section below, let me know. I'm really glad that I switched decks uh, and got the advantage now. Okay, call the toy, toy cost. I always do that. Hits. Did we get it? Yes! Yes! We won the coin toss! We are definitely going to go first. Definitely, definitely, definitely we are going to go first. Are you fucking crazy to think that we're not? Woo. Please wait while your opponent chooses an act. Come on. We're going to go ahead and throw this up there. What, is, what does this do? Draw three cards? Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. And then the lucky helmet. Oh, hopefully we can get something good. 
Hopefully we can get uh, the evolution to Tepic. I can't remember what his name is off the top of my head. Nope, we did not. Can we get him now? Can we get him now, though? No, but we can get an Entei and a Torchic, which is going to be just as good. What is Entei's? Uh, this attack does 20 damage for each of your opponent's benched Pokemon. That's not all that great, though. Discard the top four cards of your deck. Okay, yeah, I remember that one. Um... You know, we're going to go ahead and we're going to throw that on him, throw this on him, and then we are also going to, um, we're going to throw the fire up on Tepig. Oh, yeah, sorry. Keep forgetting. Keep forgetting. Okay, what are you, oh, we got a Zapdos over here too, don't we? Yeah, we do. I have a Zapdos in this deck. I don't have a Moltres though, actually. That is then Moltres and Lugia. Moltres, Lugia, and Hoho are the only original OG legendary birds that I don't have. Although my Zapdos is different too. I still have Zapdos, but it's a different Zapdos. I know, I'm probably not in sync with the music. <laughs> uh, roll out! Oh yeah, no, he wants to get that Zapdos up here. Yeah, he does. You want to get that Zapdos up here. I see you being all sneaky and throwing your elements on Zapdos like I'm not going to notice that you didn't put any on Voltorb. Oh yeah, he's trying to get that Zapdos set up to do his Raging Thunder. This attack is 40 damage to one of your bench Pokemon. Oh yeah, I ain't crazy though, homie. I knows, I knows this game. Okay, so we're gonna do another quick roll. We are gonna take this uh, Voltorb down as low as we possibly can uh, before we start. Before we don't, I, I obviously want to get him down as low as I possibly can. Um, but I don't think that I want to take him out just yet, especially now that he can use his Raging Thunder. Because that Raging Thunder is going to be deadly. 120 damage. I've got to be able to take 120 damage out of him uh, very quickly. This got an energy card attached to this Pokemon. Yeah, see, Roar, I would love to get Imbor out. So can I draw the evolution to it though? Ooh. Okay, okay. So he's looking to evolve. Looking to get that quick Dodrio. Okay, Pablito. I don't know if that's how you pronounce that. If I'm wrong, I'm real sorry about that. Sorry, not sorry. Let's see. Okay, so we're going to have the fire. So we're actually going to throw this on Tepig. And then we're just going to call it. We're going to call it a turn. Because uh, <laughs> I really don't want that Zapdos coming out until I have a way to beat it. Until I have something that can just basically one-shot that, that Zapdos, I do not want that Zapdos out here. And I'm not about to fall for that trick. Because that Zapdos will take out all three of my Pokemon very, very quickly. And there ain't going to be diddly shit stick that I'm going to be able to do about it. I see, I think she realized, I think she's, she's realizing what I'm doing and she's trying to think of, uh, think of a plan B. I think that's why it's taken so long to get this turn done. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Dodrio, okay, okay. Oh, is that another? That is. That is another Zapdos. Oh, man. That's going to be so fucking deadly for me. Let's see. 20 damage for each bench uh, Pokemon. Let's see. That's 60, 80 damage. That's not a lot. That's not a lot. I need him to get all five out because then that's 120 damage. If I can do that, we will be uh, pretty freaking golden with this Entei. Okay, Pablito, 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 2000. Oh, yeah. See, now she's trying to get that other. Oh, how do we want to do this? Ooh. 
you know what? We're going to go ahead and throw this energy up on Tepig. Uh, just in case they do take out this Tepig, uh, it'll come back straight to my hand. I'll be able to re-summon him on the bench and then hopefully evolve him into Embor here soon. I'm really hoping the next evolution is not in my prize cards. Knowing my luck is probably exactly where it's at. Okay, so there we go. We're going to draw a couple new cards. Awesome! Right here, baby. Right here. Alright. Let's see, what do we need? Okay, uh, so two fires. Two fires, and then two... Okay. So we actually should be fairly good right there. So I'm going to throw these up on Intei, just in case. Uh, and we're going to call that a turn for right now. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna call that a turn. Because I'll tell you what, if that... Okay, 150 damage. So if that Zapdos comes out, he's not going to be able to take him out right away. Um, however, I'll still be able to take one Zapdos out, but I won't be able to take the second Zapdos out. And that's where it's going to get dangerous right here. Oh yeah, you're going to try and paralyze me. The Paralyzer! Comment down below if you get that reference. All you old fucks like me, you will probably get it. Ooh, that's going to be good for me. Let's see if we're going to draw a couple more cards. We're going to evolve. Oh, do, 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 do. Actually, I don't think I can. Yeah, because I already have one up there. Mm, so that's not going to be that good for me. Can I use this Fire Blast if I want to, though? Yes. Okay. Flip a coin of heads. This attack, this attack does 30 more damage. Um, mm, I'm going to have to anyway. I'm going to have to anyway. I'm going to have to. That's going to have to come out at some point. At least I will get me another car. Okay, another Fire Energy. That's not bad. Uh, but I'm going to have to take out that Voltorb one way or another. So you might as well just... I might as well get rid of it now and get the Zapdos out and take care of him as soon as possible. I really wish I could have uh, equipped this giant cape to my Imbor. That way, he'd have had that, that health bonus. Of, what is it? 20? Yeah, 20, uh, 20 HP bonus. Oh yeah, now they got that Zapdos ready and raring to go. See, so this is, this is a little dangerous. This is a little... Uh, this, these are the kind of battles that I like. Even though that they're probably going to take 20, 30 minutes to do, these are the kind of battles that I like because it does take a little while and it does take some strategic planning. And uh, it is... It's going to be a difficult match. Okay, so we have... Okay, so we're going to throw this Lucky Helmet up on Torchic. Um, and then we're actually going to throw this energy up on Torchic as well. Um, draw a card to you, five cards in hand during your turn. Pokemon's attack to 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon. You know what? I'm actually going to save that for next turn. Uh, when I use Entei. I'm going to use that because I know that this... Choose an energy card to discard. I know that this um, this next Zapdos is going to take out my Imbor. Okay, Finnegan, I can deal with that. So, what my plan is, is I'm going to put Entei out after they take him out. Oh, but that's not going to be enough. They don't have anywhere near enough benched Pokemon for that to work. And that's only their benched Pokemon, right? For Yeah, each one of your opponent's benched Pokemon. Oh yeah, that's going to suck. So actually, I probably don't want to do that until they get more benched Pokemon out there. And of course, Zapdos. Of course, they're going to bring Zapdos back. Son of a bitch. Right to the top of the deck. Man. How does that not take... Okay, 80, that's why. Oh, you know what? We're going to... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Select a, a basic energy. Okay, here we go. We're going to take that one. Come on, come on, come on, take your prize card, and then we're going to put Torchic up here, actually. Yeah, I think I think Torchic's going to be our best bet right now, uh, until they get more benched Pokemon out there. Okay, 
Okay. Moltres. Uh, you may do 40 more damage. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I guess I do have Moltres. Maybe it's... I think it's Zapdos. Actually, yeah. I think it... I think it might actually be Zapdos that I don't have. So, we're going to throw that up there. We're going to throw this over here. We're going to throw this out. Bam, bam. Take these. Throw this Finnekin out. Okay. I think we might be might be good and actually you know what fuck it while we can i'm gonna get that live coal action in there and i'm just gonna i'm gonna chip away at that health as best i can so far i am still winning which is crazy absolutely crazy that i'm still winning Ooh, plus 60 health that's gonna suck oh man oh and they use it on dodrio that is smart that is smart Okay, select a basic energy. Bada bing. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we're going to go ahead. Will you get up here? Oh, select a basic energy. Okay, there we go. Ooh, that was, that was pretty freaking ingenious as a matter of fact. Okay, go ahead, pick your prize card. And then we're actually going to move Entei up here because I want to take some damage out. I want to take some serious damage out. Okay, what do we got here? Draw three cards. Uh, search your deck for three basic energy cards. Reveal them. Okay, I don't want that. I want to draw the three cards this turn. All right. That is exactly what we want. So we're going to throw that up there. We're going to throw Finnekin out there. Um, and we're going to do a, oh, how do I want to do this? You know what? We're just going to go for it. We're going to do the combat blaze. This match is about to take a long time. So I hope, ladies and gentlemen, you guys are enjoying the ride because this is a very, very intense match. This is probably one of the closest matches I have ever had. And it's, I think it's mostly because I see what they're going to do and I see what they're trying to do right from the get-go. And it just makes it that much better. Raging Thunder yet again. Oh, man. See, they're trying to not... <laughs> they're trying to not... Um, what am I trying to say? They're trying to not... Uh, make that raging thunders effect. Oh yeah, no, we gotta we gotta go for broke. I can't I can't stall forever. Now that next that next zap dose is going to be a pain. But you know what? If we can get let's see, um discard a fire energy. Attach this Pokemon. Uh, look at the top three cards of your deck. Okay, um We're gonna go ahead and throw this over here. Victory? What happened? Did they surrender? Did she really surrender? No! No, I did not want that. Am I the only one around here gives a shit? I did not want that at all. Oh, you're joking me, right? You're pulling my chain, dog. That sucks. I really wanted to take this all the way and see whose deck was going to come out on top. That really sucks. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I guess that's it for this video. As always, if you're new to the channel, make sure you smash that like button if you had fun here. If you thought that that was a close match, comment down below, guys. I want to know your personal opinion. Who did you think was going to win that battle? Who did you think was going to win that battle? Let me know that down in the comment section below. I, Because honestly, guys, I cannot tell you who would have won that. That was so freaking close. But that's it for this video, guys. And I will see you all in the next one. This is Superman Ryan signing off. Peace, guys.